In this tutorial, you are going to learn how to read Deja Vu on an iPad. This tutorial is also going to cover moving the file to the iPad. First of all, you are going to need to have a program for reading Deja Vu files. Go to the App Store and search for the program Book Reader Lite. On the search results page, you will see a program with a red thumbnail. This is what you want to install. As we already have the program, we can see that it just says open rather than install. You will also need a program that allows you to transfer files to your iPad. Here we are using Dropbox. You can also install this application through the App Store. First, you need to go to Dropbox and locate the file that is in the Deja Vu format. Touch it and the file will load. As this format is not supported by Dropbox, you will be told that the program is unable to view file. This is expected. Touch the download icon to the top right and from the options that appear, touch Open in Book Reader. You will switch over to the new app and you need to touch Remind Me Later in the dialog box that appears. You will see your Deja Vu file has appeared in the reader as a thumbnail and you just need to touch it to open it. You are now able to browse through the files by swiping your finger across the screen and that is how to view a Deja Vu file on an iPad.